Hello everyone, I'm all about Sonic the Telltale Gamer, and welcome to my Let's Play of Batman the Enemy Within, Episode 1, The Enigma. So, here we are, we are finally, finally getting to Season 2 of Batman, and now, I gotta say, I was a huge fan of Season 1. I, I really liked it, definitely in my top 5 favorite Telltale games, um, but now, like, I've neglected finishing Season 1 for so long, like, I, I finished it, I never got around to, like, just editing it together for so long, and now here we are, we're gonna be playing through... The first four episodes of Batman Name then before episode five comes out. Right now, we, it is Saturday, March 24th. We are three days away from the release of Batman Name within episode five, same stitch. So, um, we have, um, I just gotta say, I, can we just take a moment to appreciate how awesome this opening theme is? I really like this, this, and I gotta say, I thought currently, like, Minecraft Story Mode had the greatest, um, music of any Telltale game. Batman, Batman and and this enemy within even from the sound this menu theme. I really like this um theme. It's this main menu theme is a lot better than season one's in my opinion. Um, but season one's was really good too. Um, I like the contrast. Like we had a white theme in season one. Now we have a black theme in season two. Um, a lot of people have been saying that Batman the Enemy Within is perhaps one of the greatest Telltale games of all times. The greatest game, the best. Not the greatest, I'm um, the best Telltale game since um, Tales from the Borderlands and The Walking Dead Season 1, which I think is really impressive, considering right now my favorites are Tales from the Borderlands and Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, I honestly, I thought Batman was Season 1 was really good, but I didn't, I wouldn't quite say that it was in my, my like, my top, it's definitely my top 5, but I don't think it's better than, like, Walking Dead Season 1, Season 2, Tales from the Borderlands and Guardians, but, um, who knows, um, I can't wait to, this gives me hope, though, that, um, seeing as how Telltale's gotten some readjustments in its management staff, that Walking Dead Season 4 and Wolf Among Us Season 2 won't suffer the fate that, like, New Frontier and Game of Thrones got, so, I'm really hoping, lucky for that, um, if you're excited for this Let's Play as much as I am, be sure to like, comment, and, of course, subscribe, let's go ahead and jump into this. Oh, that's so cool. If you listen right now, it actually has, like, parts of the Season 1 theme in it. That's cool. It's kind of like a remix of the Season 1 theme. That's cool. Alright, let's see what the title screen is going to look like. Is it going to be, like, the exact same as, um, Season 1 with, like, switch distance between Bruce and Batman? Oh, it's the back computer this time. Okay. Ooh! I like how sleek it looks this time. Oh, it even has the same sound effect from, um, Season 1. Oh, that's great. Um... All right, let's take a look at our settings. Make sure everything's up to speed there. Oh, oh, it's just, oh, the bat. We got the bat suit now. I think now I remember really that's the season one bat suit. I think that is either that or it's the suit that um you wore if you took down Harvey um Oz at the beginning. Oh no no no. See because look if you look in the background right there, that's the season one suit. I think the suit right here is the armored suit that you got in season one if you chose to um at in episode five because if you I looked at this if you went after. Oz in, at, at the end of episode 4 instead of Harvey, you would have gotten this armored suit to use against, um, Vicky because she didn't take down your, uh, because Oz didn't take down your tech, but since he took down a tech, I got the, the classic, like, animated suit, but now, like, if you, so I guess if you went after Oz, you would have gotten, like, this armored, like, Dark Knight, more Dark Knight or Justice League suit, um, let's go ahead and, um, go into our, um, let's, uh, I don't see graphics anywhere, we have, oh, audio display probably under, yeah, here we go, alright, let's set our master volume to, like, 5, just so we don't have any, like, um, uh, what do you call it? Issues. Um, turn on subtitles. Subtitle size large. Um, everything seems fine. Oh, there here's your graphics now. Texture quality set that to high. Um, um, having some trouble there. Let's set ambient occlusion to high. Depth of field to high. Bokeh on high. We're gonna push it as hard as we can, and then if it suffers, we'll just mess with it. All right. So now here we go. Let's go into episode one. Oh, choose how to begin your story. Alright, so just like Minecraft Storm of Season 2 and A New Frontier, we can either, um, just start, go ahead and start the game or bring over our choices from Season 1. So that's where we're going to continue our story. Um, we're going to go on with Save 2. That was, um, like, I Save 1, I had, like, just some, like, mess, like, just messing around with stuff. So we're going to go Save 2. Your backstory is complete. Your backstory tied to current save. I'll see. Oh, that's a, that, see, that's a new backstory compared to the, um, the one we had in Season 1. The, the cow looks different. So, um, alright, let's see what our episodes got. Episode 1, The Enigma. Oh, oh, that's cool. It's got, like, um... See, now, now I said that, oh, um, the Riddler was going to... What if the Riddler was, um... Was... If Victoria Arkham was the Riddler. Obviously, I was wrong. But now, look, the Riddler is in this episode. So, Episode 1, The Enigma. One of Gotham's deadly, oldest and deadliest criminals has returned. Batman must work with allies old and new to stop this growing threat. Okay. Episode 2. 
Episode 2, The Pact. With his identity on the line, Bruce must work with a new power player in Gotham. A criminal conspiracy is growing in the shadows for an entire city. Whoa, 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 wait! Are they actually putting Harley Quinn in this? Oh my god, I was like kidding that like, oh like, oh my god. Now see, this is what I thought, like, I didn't think Telltale would do this. Like, because the way season 1 was, I thought season 1 was going to be like, um, oh, like... I heard, like, oh, like, how are they gonna handle, like, people like Bane and Harley Quinn and, like, Mr. Freeze with a Joker? Because they're really, like, cartoony villains, and Telltale have always seems, like, really serious. So that's, like, when I saw that, like, Telltale was gonna do, like, the Penguin and Two-Face and more, like, realistic t Batman villains. I'm like, okay, I can understand that. But now, look, we got Harley Quinn, Bane, and I don't know who that is, so, but that's definitely Harley Quinn and um, Bane in there. So I'm curious to see how it's gonna handle them. Episode 3, Fracture Mask. Oh, that's Selena. All right, so she's gonna come back at some point this game. That's nice. As the pressure to uncover the impending attack on Gotham intensifies, Bruce navigates his dual identity and his relationship with his new allies. Oh, okay. So maybe, like, he works more, because we know that Joker is going to be a v very big main character in this game. So that's that. Episode 4, that's, look, that, there's a Joker right there. Episode 4, what ails you? A shocking revelation forces Bruce into desperate change of plans as the villain's lethal plot escalates. All right. And then episode 5... Same stitch. That's Batman fighting someone. It kind of looks like Joker that he's fighting. I'm not sure. For the looming threat on Gotham reaches its the looming threat on Gotham reaches its boiling point, forcing Bruce to decide how far he's willing to go to protect his city from a force that threatens to bring it to its knees. And for more from Deep Sea Telltale, we have once again the Wolf Among Us and more Telltale games. I'm surprised they're not advertising season one here, though I'm assuming if like you were playing this, you played season one. So um, yeah, we're gonna start our journey into back into Gotham with episode one, The Enigma. Let's do this. Oh, I wonder, um, we have our, like, um, thing really here, so let's do that. I wonder if we're gonna, like, be able to choose our bat tech color, like, in Season 1. Up, oh, yep, here we go. Alright, so just like in Season 1, we have the color to change to choose our bat tech. So we have blue, which is the Arkham Batman. Uh, red, Batman Beyond Batman. Yellow, that's, um, that's, like, classic Batman. And then purple, which is just, like, if you want to have a purple Batman, you can. Um, I chose blue last time in Season 1, so I, I think we're gonna stick with that. This game seems to demonstrate some extra stuff how you play. Now, here's one thing I wonder. Is it going to be widescreen like Season 1? Because, here's the thing. I didn't mind it that much in Season 1 because it was, um... Alright. Oh, alright. So, Troy Baker is playing Bruce once again. Batman Reese. Batman Steeljaw. Take your pick. Until I learned the truth. Yeah, Thomas Wayne was like an asshole. Wayne was a criminal. He ruled over Gotham from the shadows. Mm-hmm. And everything I thought I knew about myself changed forever the children of Arkham he, sa he sounds a lot like um uh steel jaw here attack turned friends and enemies oh it's full screen thank God oh that's great Arkham asylum where I escaped with the help of a mental oh yep from episode four John Doe is the Joker by the way I put an end to it all in the catacombs that's when we fought Vicky the penguin two face and uh-huh Arkham were the first real challenge I faced as the okay but they would not be the last. All right. All right, nice. It's nice that we have it in full screen this time. Um, Spring has arrived in Gotham. That sounds like um, Jack Ryder. Quarterly crime report. Crime is way down there goes Batman. The of the of Arkham, marking another triumph. Oh, yeah, and Gordon became commissioner at the NC1. Oh, yeah, NC1, we got, like, he almost got assassinated, but um, we saved him. His success to the public partnership between the police and the Batman. Oh yeah, and because because I chose to go to the um, I go I went to the place as um, as Batman instead of Bruce. Oh, here we go. Here we have the Riddler. Oh, that's cool. It kind of looks like a sickle with oh the Virago. 11:42 p.m. Now Falcone's dead too. So yeah, like, we don't. I want to see like. There it is. Romy Mori, import export mm -hmm. magnet, one time Pipex CEO. Uh huh. International it's so weird France seeing Batman in full screen. <laughs> sees Mori as a legitimate businessman, uh -huh. a philanthropist who gives to charity. Oh, is this Bruce? Getting rich off the suffering of innocence. Hey, Bruce, what up? It's been a while. I wonder 
If a man hides in plain sight for that- Oh, whoa, Alfred! You look a lot more HD and kind of uglier. Bruce looks the same. I never forget who I am. We all hide our true selves. You can become the role. I never forget who I am. I don't. I never forget what drives me. Protecting the innocent from people like Mori. That stays the same no matter what mask I Oh, so he's, so he's Falcone 2.0, Mori. Yeah, Alfred looks a little, um... If there are uh, he, Mori, kinda he's kind of ugly. He's got he got the new frontier treatment. Oh, we what? I have like Google Glass in my eyes. Meaning that if he's doing arms deals in Gotham, kind of looks like how Kenny did in New Frontier. Floor. I need to find a way to hear what Mori is saying. Don't you have like a microphone? That's crazy. Like his eyes, he's got like Echo Eye, like Reese. <laughs> it's funny because Troy Baker also voiced Reese. Roulette table. Um, Mori's cell phone. Okay. Security, let's look at security. security are guarding in oh, I thought that was Mori's security. A man like Mori counts more enemies than friends. Alright. I wonder why that is. It's good to know. Um, let's look at him. He certainly enjoys the good life, doesn't he? Made a fortune running guns during the Arab Spring. Diversified into biotech shortly after. And that's Ayn Rattel that's still voicing Alfred. He is not one for pinching pennies. Um, alright, let's, let's look at his phone now. Consumer model could be a good way to hear Mori's conversation. Yeah, hack the microphone on it. All right, let's do it. Al, I'm hacking into Mori's phone. Yeah, Bruce pretty much looks the same though. But Alfred, jeez, that's so like I, I don't know, like just that's just not how like I remember Alfred in season one. Bruce looks the same though. Don't worry, I won't tell anyone with a bad. He's on a roll. It's only a matter of time before he gets too chatty. He kind of sounds like Mori. Kind of sounds like I'm Hanzo from Overwatch. Hey, what up? I'm Bruce Wayne, you know. You know, I my father did some shit, but it's nice to hear like people not like um like insulting me. Bruce Wayne doing in a place. If you bring my father, I swear to God. I figured you went to fancy. You're not my type. I'm undercover, looking for a thrill. I'm looking for a thrill. High rollers go. I'm looking for something different. Well, Bruce kind of kind of looks different. Like his hair looks more HD. Oh, he looks a little older too. You? What in the hell are you doing here? Oh, oh shit! That's Riddler. Stop me if you've heard this one before. I oh, he's gonna riddle me this. <laughs> and I end all that begins. Who am I? I don't give a damn. I told you ten times. Our arrangement is over. Death, Mori. I am death. Something's happening, and it doesn't look like a deal. Yeah, Bruce looks- Oh, oh, I just noticed! His ear, his chunk of his ear is still missing. Look, his chunk of his ear is still missing when Vicky blew it out in, um, season one. Oh, shit, Riddler's got his own gang. All right, we gotta stop him. Is something wrong? You seem distracted. Do you not see the guy with the gun? Bruce. Go away, meet me outside, come with me, um. Yeah, I'll say meet me outside. How about we go back to my place? Oh. I'll call my driver. Meet me outside. Well, since you put it like that, I never do this, you know. You know, me neither. All right, good. No I one swear. threatens me in my own casino. Security! <laughs> Sir, it's time yeah, it's totally, that's totally um, Paul Nakuchi, who voices um, Hanzo. What question can you never answer yes to? I don't give a crap. Let's go. <sighs> Wrong. The correct answer. Is are you dead? Oh! Oh shit! Oh, it's fucking like his his staff is like a sickle. Oh shit! Now, let's get started. Get out of there! Get your suit. You got it. All right, I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna pull Clark Kent, even though I'm not Clark. I'm not Superman. Let Gordon know what's happening. Right away. Hey, no uh, Commissioner needs. Gordon. Yeah, what are you gonna do about it? I right, right. I wonder if they're still gonna have like the Batman meter from um season one, like like the little like finisher set thing. I right, right. And down A! Wrecked! Yeah, no gun. Hmm. 
You badass Bruce. You still got kind of like a chunk of your ear missing though, that's kind of off-putting. It's gonna be weird seeing him without like a part of his ear for the entire season. Commissioner Gordon on the line, scrambling audio now. Gordon. Batman. Yeah, Bruce that? looks a lot older in this thing than season one. I, I... Oh, the Sideswipe Mobile, it's back! <laughs> I remember, I remember the Batmobile, how they can like transform. Multiple gunmen, hostages at the casino. Oh, I got my bat suit right in it. In a mask. Riddler's oh, it's playing the season one theme. Riddler. He has a bit oh, even Gordon years. looks a bit. It's well, even, he looks even gold. Gordon even looks older. Everyone looks older than they did in season one. All right, let's let's gear up. Yep, this is the season one theme. Be, there shortly. be ready for a fight. But I like the lighting too. It's a, very similar to um new. They they learned a lot from um New Frontier in terms of like updating the graphics and all that. This is running super smoothly compared to um to season one. Yeah, because I, I saw that was like a big problem with people had with season one was that fact that season one was like a technical mess. But then they they fixed it with um they fi they fixed it in update apparently like shortly before season um Enemy Within came out. Please, please, we can make the deal. Anything you want. Our issues can't be solved. Oh, what, is, what is that? Is that? This is what happens when what you is that? out of a deal with me. Oh, a torture chamber? There's only one way. When did the Riddler turn the, the jigsaw? You have to solve a riddle, and I choose my words carefully. If I were you, listen closely. No, please, don't do this. Without. Oh my God! This totally saw. I point. Without arms, I strike. Without feet, I run. Who am I? Um, darkness. I've got visual. That drone fully functional. Oh, the, the drone even looks a little more high tech than it did in um season oh, one. Still kind of looks the same though, but like with a little updates. Time for some recon. It's a tricky one, isn't All it? Alright, uh, it's a good Riddler. At the very nature of our existence. Riddler. A terror from the past. I never thought I'd see him on our streets again. He's not to be taken lightly. I got it, Alfred. Um, let's look at Mori. Death chamber. That does not sound good. Doesn't seem like he's getting out until yes. he guesses the riddle. His this hands are like um. Certainly has an imagination. It's gonna like cut off his like fingers. Remember, choose your words carefully, Mori. You um, guards. So What's that? Cashier. Cashier's booth. That'll do. Just need to take out the guard first. Can I like shoot like a stun dart at him? Like shock him. Let's see what we got. Distract, all right. Oh, like run. Distraction. Just like run him out, like like run it into him. Oh, nice. I'm Batman X. Nice. Shh, I'm Batman. I like this looks like he looks a lot more like slanted like and like sharper with this outfit than he did in season one Are you expecting a hint? Give me an answer All right, um We can't get in Yeah, I see that Gordon They've got the back barricaded with blackjack tables How should I Oh no blackjack tables I'm relying on your Make a frontal assault hit them with tear gas. Oh um Hey, what's your guess? Cause I can take them. We need a distraction. Find a way to limit their line of sight. Sounds like a plan. Yeah, Commissioner Gordon. Oh, oh, so cut his fingers say. off. No, I don't believe that's it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I'll clear a path. Wait for my signal. Give him hell. We're counting on you. All right, let's do this. We got a grapple gun. Uh, oh, bash, rope stand, or grapple smoking sign. Uh, uh, smoking sign. RT. Oh, nice. Oh, this is cool. Uh, slam into coffee table, tear off roulette wheel. Uh, let's tear off the wheel. And right Y. Nice. Oh, I, love, I really like this. This is cool. Hey, what up? I'm a little busy right now, but I'll see if I can fit you in. He kind of sounds like um Robert Eckley Downs who voiced who voiced um Duncan in um Game of Thrones. Oh no, you don't! I got a Taser. Anchor the gun. Anchor hostage. Uh, uh, anchor hostage. See what that does. 
Uh, hit all targets in any order. All right, AY. RT. Oh, pull her out of the way of the shot. That's nice, right? Not. Oh, I thought that was gonna like stab him in the head and kill him. Let's go, Riddler. All right, Rusty. Nice. Hiya, bats. Bat hey, what up? Clearly isn't using his head. Break it open. With pleasure. Oh, what? Well, did you hit me with a wrench? You're not Badger. I can take you. All right. Uh, left. And down. And right X. So I guess like the finisher system from season one is gone, which is um I don't really mind because the if I'm honest the meter there was kind of annoying. And oh finisher oh all right so, so the meter is invisible this time but we still have like finishers that's cool. Tie him down or shock him oh uh shock him. And right B oh nice oh I I'm pretty sure you find his brain Bruce oh shit. I've heard stories in the streets about you, Batman. You're the biggest name in Gotham since, well, since I left town. See, that's interesting. Like that, all these supervillains like existed before Batman. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, I cut off another finger. I'm not impressed. Gotham's criminals have become zealots and thugs in cheap suits, and you, I've come home to find a wannabe in my chair. Eating my goddamn you, you don't know me. This is you're just ordinary city. scum. You're, no. you're just ordinary scum. All you scum are the same. Only thing that changes is the mask. Spoken like a man who sees the world in black and white. Pretty Allow much. To broaden your spectrum. What well, we you're got? Supposedly the world's greatest detective. All right. Here you are, completely at oh. my mercy. Oh, I, Gordon, I tear gas him. Nice. Now we can take him. Have to be kidding. Left. Hey. Oh, get wrecked, Riddler. But not smart enough. And right. And down. Let me show you. Up. How it was done. And right. Back in the day. Down again. Get that shit out of my face, B. Nice. And hey. Oh, she's got a cup up X. And right A. Nice. Nice, yeah, Gordon. Alright, let's go get Mori out of there. Brawling like a common street hood. Says the one who's wearing a hood. Do it for me. Oh, he's, oh, and he's and he's gone. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Ooh, ooh, oh, we got, we're, gonna get, we're gonna get you out, don't worry. We're gonna get you out. Uh, hey. Oh, we gotta do, like, do some, like, hacking. Okay, 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 um, uh, oh, the box, the box right there. Alright, left. There we go. Alright, good. We're good. He's good. Let's go try to alert X. Where do you think you're going, bitch? Oh shit! Broke the cage. That's cheating. Think I care about your rules? <laughs> I heard you're a man who followed a code. Why would you save yeah. that dirtbag's life? Because he deserves. You're not you fucking Jigsaw Riddler. Calm down. Trading off the suffering of war to prove you wrong. You thought that stunt with Mori would cover your escape. I wanted to show you I could save him and still catch you. <laughs> I don't have to compromise. You haven't caught me yet. Nothing I've seen so far suggests you will. Let's get him. Uh, down X. Nice. Why? Uh, you're just a little bitch, Riddler. Honestly, you're getting like your ass handed to you by Batman. This is upsetting. <laughs> uh, left X. And up. Oh, you can shoot the staff out. Okay, that's new. All right. I can still break you though. Why? And finish him. Nice. Oh, um, roundhouse by slam. Um, by slam. Oh, oh down why? Come on, it's slam. <laughs> Enough of this. 
Oh, you're just gonna jump. Oh, he's got, oh yeah, he can use his staff as a grappling hook. But it's not enough. Let's see how you do with something a little more cerebral. Better hurry, detective. Solve my puzzle soon. Or people are gonna get hurt. And we know you can't let that happen. Oh shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, we gotta save Gordon. Oh, Mori's gonna get crushed. Oh, do we have a choice to save Gordon or Mori? Uh, X A B Y. Oh, that was pretty epic. LT. Oh, well, hold up. This isn't. This isn't Spider-Man: Homecoming. Hold up. This isn't Spider-Man: Homecoming. What is this? Like, we're not holding up like a ship for breaking apart. You just want to, you kind of want to get, you get Mori out of there before, um, I got him. Oh, oh, shock pistol? Oh, okay. That's cool. Who are you? Are you like Detective you Carson? Before going in, Gordon. Who are you? Oh, no, oh, shit. She, Amanda Wall, she's, um, she was from Suicide Squad. She was what? She's the guy, she's the girl who forms Suicide Squad. All right, there we go. Batman, the enemy within episode one. Let's do this.